Today's video will be on getting an IV on a patient with darker skin complexion. I prefer going in veins that you can visibly see over the skin surface. These tend to be the bounciest. Veins that disappear and appear, depending on your hand position, occur frequently in older adults because of their decrease in muscle mass. You often have to readjust yourself a couple times for you to find which position works best for you. Don't worry about adjusting too much. If you have to ask the patient to move in closer or have them lift up their arm, do it because it's important that you set the stage for success. You want to be able to see at least a few inches above where you plan on inserting the needle so you can easily assess for infiltration. This may require you to lift up their shirt or the patient's gown. Once you've assessed the veins with clean hands, it's time to put on your gloves. Notice how my body is aligned with the vein that I plan on inserting the needle into. You also want to have your flush ready to go. Clean the skin with an alcohol wipe using good friction and allow the area to completely dry before you insert the needle. I always recommend on giving frequent breaks from the tourniquet by removing it and then reapplying it after a few seconds. Instead of one really tight tourniquet, I like to use two tourniquets that I put on moderately tight. Using frequent alcohol pads during your assessment of the veins is important and helpful in patients with darker skin complexions because the alcohol moisture actually contours the vein and makes it a lot easier to see. Also, I recommend wiping with the alcohol pad in a down motion. Wiping it upwards, you're gonna more likely push the blood up into the valve that's above the location that you're going. Notice how I'm using both of my hands, including the ring finger of my right hand to hold the skin in place. Always check in using the entire 10 mLs of a saline flush to ensure that your IV is in the correct location. Sometimes if the patients have bigger arms, only pushing a few mLs may not show that visible infiltration.